The people of Petal, Mississippi, have lived through a number of natural disasters over the years, including last January's EF3 tornado. Now, as we approach the one year anniversary of the storm, Petal Mayor Hal Marks says the people of the friendly city continue to rebuild and recover. Alyssa Cole has the story. Nearly one year ago, an EF3 tornado swept through Petal, ripping buildings, street poles, and homes apart. Today, Petal Mayor Hal Mark says the city is close to full restoration. I've been very proud of the uh, people of Petal coming together to uh, rebuild and recover. Uh, you know, we went through the same thing four years ago, and now, you know, uh, a year ago uh, with this one. So it's something we're unfortunately getting used to. Uh, we don't want it to happen again, but I think, uh, you know, we've, we've bounced back pretty well from the one a year ago. Officials want to install more tornado sirens throughout the city. For right now, I mean, we've talked about possibly having a safe room for some of our, our employees, our, 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 our first responders, maybe having safe rooms added at the fire stations just in case something happened. Mark says the city did not rebuild on its own. A number of organizations helped the friendly city come a long way. State agencies, uh, MEMA, uh, of course, uh, Forest County Emergency Management has been very helpful to us. Um, a lot of charities, uh, Samaritan's Purse came in. Uh, we've had groups such as Mennonites that have come and helped rebuild houses. Uh, our area churches, uh, regional churches, all people coming in to help. Uh, we've had firefighters from the coast that came up to help our, our firefighters who had had homes damaged. So just a wide variety of groups, private and public, that have come in to help us. We appreciate that help. Uh, very much and uh, we intend to always remember that and if someone else needs us to help we want to repay them for that. The people of Petal are described as resilient, strong and neighborly for always helping another in need. It's, it's a great honor to be the mayor of a city with people who have been tested like this through uh, floods and tornadoes and hurricanes and, and yet they, uh, they keep bouncing back and, and come back better than ever. The mayor says despite the tornado's destruction, the Petal strong spirit lies within the silver lining. Alyssa Cole, Twin State News.